All right, y'all, welcome. Chase here. Uh, we are back with another installment of Favorite Fits. If you're not familiar with the Canoe Club channel, uh, either myself or some of the other staff will pick some fits every month, uh, try to do one a month, and then we just style it so you guys can kind of see how we would put together some of these looks. Um, but without wasting any more time, let's hop right into it. What's up guys, it's Colin, back at it. We got our uh, January favorite fit. So first we'll we'll start with the, the hat. We got this Kabalami, sort of a silver hat. Um, kind of shorter, so won't completely cover the ears, but yeah. And then for glasses, we're going with this sort of uh, tortoise shell, Native Sons pair of Mikowskis. Got like a blue tint to the lens, really dig these guys. And then for our sort of base layer or just t-shirt, we got this. Lady White Grindle Tee. These have always been popular for us. Super nice fit on these guys. And then on top of that, we got this quarter zip capital. Got the nice little smiley faces, typical capital on the elbows there. And then all this stuff is, uh, it's a little more fitted. So unlike Chase, I like my stuff to be uh, a little more true to size or fitted instead of that baggy look. And then the last piece we got here, as far as clothing goes, is gonna be these caudal straight fit jeans. Again, I don't like a super baggy jean or a super skinny jean. So something just kind of in the middle. And then uh, of course I keep them cuffed. So you can see that selvage on the bottom there. And then the last piece we got here is gonna be these New Balance 1906Rs, kind of a nice, you know, clean silver, white, a couple green hits on them, nothing crazy. If you like my fit, uh, leave a comment. If you don't, also, thanks. All right. I've got my stellar fit picked here. Got some sassafras, Aura Lee, engineered garments, our beloved William Frederick. Let's just go ahead and hop right into it. I'm gonna go top down. Chose the sassafras hat. It's our first season with sassafras. Uh, I personally love everything else in the collection. Um, I just knew this hat would go well with this jacket that I chose from Aura Lee. So we've got the sassafras hat. It has this cool little reflective SF here uh, for sassafras, not for the city of San Francisco. Um, good fit, not too shallow, not too deep. It has the perfect adjuster in the back. I hate when it has just like a hook that clamps over on itself. This is more like a, like a belt buckle. You can kind of weave it through, keep it shaped nice. Love this. The mid layer is gonna be this Engineered Garments work shirt and the black denim. Uh, if you're watching this YouTube video or you're familiar with the Canoe Club channel, you really should have one of these in general. So I'd be surprised if you don't, but I personally love these. Plenty of room here in the shoulder, which is a thing that I'm always trying to accommodate for. And then also gives me the extra length. So I have a size large here. Uh, I am like a true US large, so I just kind of stay large or XL with the work shirts. Um, this one I chose large because I know it ran a little bit big this season. I want it to poke out the bottom. I want it to have a little bit of contrast against the hairy textures or a lead jacket, which moving on to that, got this dope ass zip jacket from Aura Lee. Texture is off the charts. Uh, it's nice and roomy in the body and a little bit boxy as well. Uh, it is fully lined, so it's gonna feel nice and kind of slide on without any sort of weird texture or, or sensory kind of thing going on, but zipper all the way up. You can wear the collar up or down. This thing is dope. Everything Orly does is amazing, but this is by far my favorite piece thus far uh, since carrying them. So I really wanted to work this in. Pant wise, shout out to my buddy Bill from William Frederick. Shout out the city of Cleveland. Um, it's really cool to see manufacturing done here in the US and also more importantly in Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, if you've never been, it's really cool it's being made there. So uh, chose these pants from, from Bill. Also a black denim, has an elastic waist here. This cool contrast stitching here on the pockets and on the hem and on the waist. Um, a nice full pant leg with a very generously high rise. Um, so I'm gonna do a little cuff be able to show the shoe at the bottom, but uh, kind of playing with the textures here. It's similar to the EG work shirt texture, but different in color. And then similar in color, different in texture to the jacket. Down low, we're gonna do these New Balance 574s. Timothy always wears th this exact shoe, gray ones. Um, just kind of works with everything. So I've, I've been pulling some inspo from that. But uh, as we know, New Balance does gray really well. Easy, gonna go with everything. I got grays, blacks. I suppose like a brown in here. This will work out nicely. Uh, nice little white hit on here on the sole and then gray uppers in different uh, leathers and tones. Let's throw this on, let's see how it looks. What's 
up guys, my name is Alec. Um, it's been a while since I did a monthly favorite fit, but here I am again, and I am in front of the camera. Um, first thing, this is the Capital Silk Rayon Bones shirt. It's uh, definitely not a winter shirt, but with my overcoat, I think the colors and the patterns are gonna work very well. So we will see what happens there. Second piece, um, these are the Monkey Cisco jeans, and again, just a bunch of different textures going on, um, different patterns of blue, really cool hits there. Third piece, this is the Anorak Parka, also from Capital. Um, it's finished with this fleece thing going on, and I think the pattern of the white and the black will go well with the shirt. Um, but again, I'm just a huge fan of Capital, huge fan of different patterns going on, and hopefully they'll all coalesce into something neat. Um, lastly, color-wise, we got the black-white 990s, and I usually don't do runners or tennis shoes or anything like that. It's usually just boots and skates for me, but that's what we're here for, is getting out of our comfort zone a little bit, so we will see what happens. And yeah, here we go. All right, that was another great episode of Favorite Fits. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe. If you wanna get involved in the Discord, shoot me an email, chase at shopfinewclub.com. Show some love to the customer service podcasts, myself and Timothy, bullshitting twice a week. Um, beyond that, sound off in the comments. I'd love to know what you think of this video. Uh, suggestions for others, and uh, yeah, be in touch. Thank you.